new day. I'm just laying here in bed. We will continue the closet. I did get my package the following day on Saturday. Unwinding, about to get in the shower. Today I will be able to continue the closet. There's the bins that I wiped down. And this was brought over to me today. Since yesterday, that was a false alarm. It was not my package. This one is. A package did come yesterday. I had that feeling that mine was going to come, but it wasn't mine. I wasn't aware that anybody else had ordered anything in the home. So, yeah, I just thought it was mine. I was wondering why the other package was so darn heavy. <laughs> All right, let's bust this open so I can show you guys what I got. It's my waist trainer. Remember when I was trying to mention what type of a waist trainer I was looking into or interested in? This one's it, you guys. I was describing it like a wraparound type of waist trainer. I do have one that I've never been able to use because it just wasn't tight enough, so there was no point in using it. But this one, since you can wrap it around, you actually have the control of making it as tight as you need it and so I wanted to get this to see if it worked and I do like it I have tried it out a couple times and I definitely like it better than the clip-on one that I have this piece right here is the one that goes around the waist and you guys if you notice it has an M on it as far as the sizing goes I <laughs> I don't remember being prompted for the sizing and I didn't pay attention to it I just ordered it I didn't realize that I didn't pick a size but it worked out it fits fine thank god that silver package in the back is the one that is for the arms, this one that I just moved out of the way. That goes around the arm area. So I'm just pulling on my laptop because I wanted to see what the sizing was. And so I can show you guys the pricing. I'm just examining the material just to make sure the stitching is okay. That nothing's going to tear off. That it doesn't look too cheaply made. It looks good. So, yep. It looks, everything looks like it's intact. Look at how insanely long this is. This is so long, like super long. When I put this on, sometimes, like I like to put it on the bed or the chair, and I spin, like I turn as I'm wrapping it, and sometimes, you guys, by the end of that, I'm a little dizzy, like if I got off a carnival ride. Here we have the pricing. It was a total of $28.24. I'm just going back over the item here and just looking at the pictures. There's a video that you can look on of, I guess, how to put it on. I have not looked at it till this day. <laughs> Maybe I go and look at it. It's pretty basic, but I do want to look at it. And this is it. Just right here are some of the pictures in the videos. Originally, the total is the $19.99, and this one does come with the arm bands, which some other ones did not, and they still cost the same. So far, so good. I do like the item. I'm glad that I purchased it. If you guys are looking for a waist trainer, these types of waist trainers are pretty cool. As I mentioned, you do have the control of making it tighter, loose. I mean, you don't want to go too tight where you like hurt yourself or something. Because I do put this on sometimes when I'm cleaning and I don't put it too, too tight. I want to be able to be mobile. Here's a closer look at the arm wraps. I'm just calling them arm wraps. They do have this material where it insulates heat I'm assuming and then you know that's what helps slim down your arms. I kind of was thinking like that'd be cool if the waistband would have had that same thermal heating insulation but it does not however I don't know if it would start tearing faster if it had that 
And I do know there are some waist trainers that have that insulation that you can look at purchasing if you're interested in that. Excuse all the mess. I am still organizing, but I wanted to show you guys this package. And you guys know how it goes. When you start organizing, you make a mess, taking everything out. Right here, I'm going through this bin that I put together when I had mentioned to you guys that I would be picking stuff up around the house. Maybe I was going to be doing that or that I was going to put stuff in it. And I decided to go with placing items that I no longer wanted. Right here, I'm kind of looking at this belt, debating <laughs> if I want to give it away. Not keep it, but give it away. I noticed that it was torn, which I did not know, so that's why I had placed it in the bin. After looking at the belt, I did see that it was torn, so I went ahead and threw it. I have this old navy jean jacket, this maroon jacket, a few tops. I think I also have some pillowcases in there. And then I have these gray leggings and a bed sheet as well that I don't want. And also the blue one that was on top, the bigger blue blanket. But it doesn't fit in here, so that's not going in here, but I also don't want that. I actually have my bed cleaned off somewhat. I have these pillows that I had showed you guys that I needed to put where I needed to put the pillowcases over them. So I got that done. Then I have all these pillows over here on the chair. I forgot to put that sweater away and I folded some of the bed sheets and pillowcases. My mirror's a little bit cleaned off. Here's the floor with a few shoes. And I went ahead and put some of the bins in the closet for now for another day because it's just going to take multiple days to get this all done. In fixing my closet again, I did run into this purchase. I didn't really forget about it, but I wanted to show you guys. So I found it. I came across it and here I am showing you guys this beautiful sweater that's like a yellow orange with blue and gray. It's a flannel sweater. It has a little hoodie with the strings so that you can tie it. This pretty little thing was $14.99 and I got it at this outlet called Beals. I think it's pronounced. I'm not sure, but that's where I got it. Thank you guys for sticking around till the end. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.